weekend. I, I, I'll tell you this, there wasn't a bigger wrestling fan than me growing up in the, in the late 80s, early 90s. Uh, I lived off of wrestling and, and I remember one WrestleMania where he came out and he uh, and he beat the Honky Tonk Man in like 30 seconds. He just came out, ran in the ring, picked him up, slammed him, pinned him. And that was uh, one of the highlights of my childhood. And so uh, Ultimate Warrior is always, uh, always has a special place for me in my childhood. Now, you know what, he was a legend. He, uh, everybody knows who the Ultimate Warrior is. And, uh, it's sad and you know, of course all of our uh, prayers and thoughts and condolences go out to him and his family. And, you know, it's, it's sad, but that's uh, it's part of the sport, man. That's part of life. You know, no one gets out alive, and you just got to count your blessings every single day. But what he left behind was a legacy for sure that, that probably will never be filled again.